There's nothing like chilling with my girls. Just me and my divas taking over the world. What's up, Diva fam? It's your girl, and today's video is going to be a wig, a synthetic, affordable wig. This one you can pick up at samsbeauty.com where they got all the good stuff, okay? I'm going to apologize way in advance. I mean, it's really not under my control. There's really nothing I can do about this. However, okay, I've already been experiencing this today with Mother Nature and her clouds and sun. So if you see the color in my video keep changing, the lighting, thank you, Mother Nature, for messing up my day, okay? So anyway, you guys, so in case you guys want to know where I got this shirt from, make sure you check out my try on haul with Zappo. I love their stuff. This is one of the shirts, and this is like one of my favorite shirts right about now. I got some really nice stuff on that website. Yes. This one right here is by Outre, and this is their lace front, and it's called Body. Oh. Brazilian Boutique Body. Yeah, so her name, is, it's inspired by Brazilian Boutique, and her name is called Body. Oh, okay, so, yeah, her name is Body, okay? So the color that I got is DR27. It's a DR27, and it says free parting, easy shift from side to side. Now, I'm not really sure why they put it as a free parting because it's really not. I'm going to show you guys the cap. I went ahead last night um, prior to doing my videos. I always, like, prepare myself in advance because um, I just do. That's just what I do. Okay. Now, they're calling this right here free parting. You're not freely parting this. It's only one part. We're... You're not free to part anywhere else. And it says it's easy shifting from side to side. Well, they didn't do anything different with this wig for us to easily shift it from side to side. We've been doing that for years now, so I'm just saying. I did tweeze some of the part in it, okay? Because I'm just saying it, it needed a little bit of tweezing. So you guys know it. Let's have a comb here and a comb and an adjustable strap in the nape, which I'm going to pull real tight because, listen. I love a good wig headache. Like, seriously, I love my wigs to be so tight on my head that... Uh, so I'm not really you know. sure if Mother Nature wants it to be cloudy today or sunny. But you know what? I really feel like just closing all of my windows and just not being bothered with this natural light. But we're just going to get past that. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to put some concealer on this wig real quick. Now, it said you can easily shift it. and tell you guys I'm always honest but I really don't like this wig like seriously I really don't first of all it's misleading um with the free part free part means you can part it anywhere that was a no no also with the shifting from side to side they made it seem like they had actually constructed the wig a certain way where you could easily shift it and that's not the case we do this all the time we have to get around we have to finagle it we have to like hack it so it was very misleading, especially to someone who was like, Oh yeah, free pot, oh yeah. Somebody was really looking for that, then they got to do So it just kind of like laid there to me. Like, so you see, and I had to put like a bunch of hairspray in it just to lift it up and give it volume because it just was laying there. And also the color, I don't really like the color too much. Like, it just looks like a cheap, the blonde version of a 27. Like, I don't know, but the 27s that I'm used to, like, which are natural hair, human hair, they look a little bit different than this. They're they're a little bit not as golden like this. But, you know, it is a synthetic wig. 
If I had to choose, I would have definitely got it in a natural color, so that way there wouldn't have been no issue with it. I really do think, like, this color was not good for this particular wig, especially because it doesn't give you, like, a lot of volume. You know, like, with certain colors, you have to have, like, that volume and stuff. You need, like, more hair. Uh, overall, I think it's just like an average rig. It's misleading with its free part and shifting. That's the part that I really didn't like, but it just looks like a typical wig. Um, but I just really don't like the color as much. You will need to actually put some volume or hairspray in it if you're like me, who like their hair a little bit, you know, a little bit more fuller. But, um... Other than that, you know, it's synthetic, it's silky texture, it's a nice length. Um, it is shedding a little bit, but, you know, it's synthetic here, so I don't really care if it sheds. You know, it's not going to last forever. But, you know, the one thing that I do like, though, is it has dark roots. I hate when I have, like, a wig that's all blonde and it doesn't have any dark roots, like, honeys. But, yeah, it wasn't like, this is not one of my favorite outtrade wigs, to be honest. And I think, like, if it was probably, like, a different hair texture, it would definitely be a lot better. It would probably hold up to its volume, you know what I mean? But... I would definitely get this in like a natural color, especially because of just the, the lack of body to it or volume to it. You can definitely check out samsbeauty.com for all of their other units. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to do another video. Hopefully the next one turns out for me really well because I have had my share of disappointments today. So, yes, you guys. I love you guys. Stay tuned for more videos to come. Make sure you rate, comment, subscribe, thumbs this video up, and I'll see you in a new video. And I'll link all the information down below.